Let me ask you a question. You keep saying that Dr. York went up in court and and um admitted that he was guilty. Am I correct? He chopped out. He did, didn't go to trial, he chopped out. Did you see the video? Did I see the video of the uh, um, um I seen a few videos with him in court. What that means? He got drugs. What he did he right. what did he cop out to, Poppy? He cop out to all of those charges, the charges, not tax, not tax evasion, not that. Like 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 Prince York tried to say, he cop out to all of those charges, charges of molestation, and the reason why he copped out was because he gave those children herpes. Now, now, hold on. Now, now, what did he cop out to, though? What was the charges for him copping out? Child molestation. Or no, no. Was what was the time? What was the time that he will get if he cop out? The time that they gave him, they gave him over, over, over 100 years. Now, now, Poppy. Reason with me. Let's deal with some real truth for a minute. If a man would cop out to 200 years or to 100 years, come on, Poppy. It don't make sense. He have nothing to lose. Why would he cop out to 100 years, Poppy? He would automatically, hold on, hold on, Poppy. He would go to trial. When you look at the case, you will see that Dr. York is definitely not in his right state of mind brother come on man when you look at the case you will see that dr young is definitely not in his right state of mind brother come on man See, but y'all hate, y'all hate so damn much. Hold on, Poppy, hold on, hold on. Y'all, y'all hate so much, and you want to prove that he's that, that y'all going along everything with the damn white man told you. If the white man is the fucking devil, how come everybody all of a sudden now believes what the fucking white man is telling them? Come on, bro. So, let me ask you a question. You will tell me, just like Ben Bada, that there was a rumors in New York. Brother, brother, we're talking about Dr. York right now. Let's get on, back to on, Dr. Hold York. Hold so now, hold up, hold up. Yes. So now you will tell me that the Brooklyn Knights didn't run Dr. York ass out of Brooklyn because the rumors of him being a child molester, a child molester, been going on for over 40 years. This shit didn't just start with Dr. York. Dr. York was being accused of being a child molester since the early 70s, 60s and 70s. That may have been being a child molester, number one. Number two, not only is he a child molester, but he taught Africa Bear Bada. He is Africa Bear Bada's teacher, and he taught them about the occult. He is his teacher. He is Bear Bada's master teacher, and that's another place where Bear Bada started that practice from. He recorded his first record inside Dr. York's studio. Dr. York turned Africa Bear Bada out. He's a pedophile. All right, I hear what you're saying, brother, but guess what? You still have not proven anything. Give me some proof. Show me something. Ain't no man. For example, I'm going to court. I'm not going to cop out to 100 damn years, Poppy. What do I got to lose in going to trial? I'm already in court. I'm 50 something years old already. I'm 40 something years old already. And I'm going to court for 100 years. Why would that man cop out? You know why he copped out, Poppy? I know why he copped out. Why he copped, he copped out? out? He copped out because he didn't want his medical records to be released and lose all his followers because his medical records were being told the story of him, him giving them children. He gave all of those children herpes. All right, Poppy. He copped out, my brother, because he wanted to release his wives. The fucking white man had all of his wives and everybody locked down in the dungeons. So he said, I'm going to take the fall. And you can see he was already drugged up, Poppy. He was drugged up. And you can see he was already drugged up, Poppy. He was drugged up. No man is going to go inside the shit and go and, and say, I'm going to cop out to 100 years. Who does that? 
you might as well go to trial. You got, you think Dr. York was that stupid, Poppy? Something else was bigger than that. Come on, man. I don't believe, and hold on, I don't believe that Dr. York was having, was molesting little boys. How old was Tyreek? Tyreek was what? He said he was what? Seven years old? I don't believe that. Now, I have a right to my own opinion. I don't believe that. I don't believe he was having sex with little boys. Dr. York had 50 beautiful fucking wives, women. I don't believe that. that. He did not go to jail for molesting. He did not get sentenced for molesting and child abuse. He did not go to jail for molesting. He did not get sentenced for molesting and child abuse. You understand you're charged with 40 counts of aggravated child molestation that you could receive and receive a maximum sentence of 30 years in confinement for each count that you're charged with 34 counts of child molestation that you could receive a maximum sentence of 20 years in confinement for each count that you're charged with one count of sexual exploitation of children and you could receive a maximum sentence of 20 years in confinement and you're charged with two counts of influencing witnesses and you could receive a maximum sentence of 10 years in confinement for each count and that you could receive a minimum sentence overall of 10 years on probation. I'm telling you the most and the least. Do you understand that? That's where y'all all got it wrong. He didn't go to jail for that. He didn't go to jail for molesting, brother. He didn't go to jail for molesting, brother. He went to jail for a whole different other shit. He went to jail for a whole different other shit. So if he didn't go to jail for molesting, then why was those children on the stand testifying, on the stand, and got their testimony? If anybody, all you got to do is stay in court for the record. They testified and said everything he did to them in the bedroom. So if they wasn't in court for justice for what he did to them, then why would the district attorney even have them on the stand? That doesn't make any sense. Poppy, do you believe in the white man now? All of a sudden, you believe in the white man? Do I believe in the white man? Yeah. Did dogs fly? All right, so so you don't believe in the white man. So why do you believe the white man now, brother? Why you believe in him now? Here's the thing, Sai. I'm not one of those Negroes that's going to sit up there and act like one out of three females is not being molested. One out of six young men is not being molested. We know we got rapists in our community. We know that. We may, we know the black men, when we walk the street, we hate each other. We know people go to jail for rape. Let's stop acting like black people don't commit black or black crime. Let's not act like we all don't have an uncle or a grandfather that done molested all of the children in the family. Like, let's stop pretending that the white man is making up the stats and that black man don't do no wrong. All right, my brother. See, now, let me talk to my people. Y'all keep saying, saw you wrong. Saw you fucked up on this one. Y'all don't understand. Saw you wrong. Y'all think saw that don't know what he's saying. Y'all are dealing with slow gases. Y'all niggas are really dumb. Some, some of you are stupid. And the reason I got to come out like that is because y'all all in here, saw you wrong. Saw, oh, how can you do that? So the really stupid motherfuckers is you. And y'all niggas are stupid in the chat room. God damn, I've been here for 20 damn years, man. You think I don't know what's going on? Come on, man, sit your ass down. Let me and Poppy deal with this shit. Sit your ass down and enjoy this damn conversation. Damn, y'all niggas is weak. Damn, y'all niggas is slow. Y'all niggas are slow, man. God damn. So go ahead, Poppy. If I was to have sex with a nine-year-old, would you say that I am a molester? 